a traditional folk high school is a Danish phenomenon. The folk high schools are still common in Denmark. One of these schools is Valle High School, which was established in 1865. In the later years, a lot of foreigners have attended this school. Most of them are Hungarians. Robert Kovacs, who is 23 years old, is one of the Hungarian students this semester. He decided after finishing his education from a university in Budapest that he wanted to study abroad. Robert didn't have any concrete plans, but he had heard about the folk high schools in Denmark and thought it would be interesting to try something completely different from what he had tried before. So Robbie, what is the main reason you decided to attend that in folk high school? In the university there was a program called Erasmus by which uh, you can go abroad to study. But unfortunately I missed it. And uh, that's why I decided uh, I just wanted to go abroad after finishing the university. And my main aim was uh, to improve my English skills. And I have heard about this school uh, from one of my friends who was here a uh, few years ago. And uh, this opportunity seemed the cheapest way to go abroad. So you say it's the cheapest way, then uh, how much have you paid for this thing? Uh, it was uh, 100 euros registration fee. And uh, we had a a study trip in Berlin for a week and it was uh, 500 uh, euros but I think it was worse Yeah, can you say something about uh, what you have learned during your stay so far? Uh, the lessons are uh, more uh, practical and uh, creative and uh, totally different uh, from that I'm, I'm used to in the university uh, so you don't have to pass an exam and you don't get a degree either, but I think you can learn how to use your uh, your uh, creativity. So do you think yeah, the school is full of your expectations? Yeah, more or less. Because I thought uh, we would uh, have to learn more, but we don't have to, and I don't mind it. But I thought uh, we would learn Danish, and we don't. Uh, I mind it a bit. And as far as the people, the students are concerned, uh, I expected more people than we are here. We are here around 20. But actually, uh, we know each other well. And uh, I think, uh, th yeah, the people uh, fulfilled my expectation. Even though my friend told me that uh, maybe they will be a bit reserved in the first two weeks, but they weren't. They were so open from the beginning. So taking into consideration that you don't get a degree, do you think it's worth studying here? Yeah, for me it's absolutely because I have already a degree, and uh, I think it's it counts a good degree in Hungary and I just uh, wanted to improve my uh, English skills and to make a uh, friendship and uh, to get to know a uh, new culture like Danish but there are some people here who are uh, from uh, who are before university and maybe they think they don't think the same So, if you want to break away from your daily life, then Valle High School offers you opportunities to spend a couple of months with people from other countries. In the same time, the students from the newest members of the EU get financial support from the Danish government. Therefore, it can be regarded as a cheap way to practice your English every day. The students at Valle are always involved in the process of how the lessons should be. For that reason, the students have to use their creative mind all the time. 
as the people of Folk High School says, it's learning for life.